Well, how do there, chums and the viewers? Right now, Ivy does a lot of gardening, and something that she keeps telling me is that slugs and snails are really getting on her nerves and eating all of her vegetables. So I've decided to 3D print something to help her with this problem. So what I have done, people, is I've made her a sign that says no slugs or snails allowed. And I've put a little spike on the bottom so we can put it into the ground nice and easy so it stands up. So yeah, all slugs and snails approaching that garden and be like, hold on, we're not allowed any further. And turn away. Heck yeah. Chums, I was told by people on gardening websites that slugs and snails can't read. So I've made a braille version. This one you can just lay on the ground in front of this sign that's in braille. So if they can't read the sign or they're visually impaired, at least they can crawl over the braille version and then they understand that they're not allowed any further. Problem solved, Katie. Okay, so it's not going to take me long to 3D print my slug signs. So there we go, it's printing right now. And I just figured, I'm actually using grey PLA. It's quite dark. Now these slugs, they tend to come out at night, don't they? You know, I'll show you what I'm trying to protect anyway. This is my, this is my partner's garden. So she does all this gardening, it's bloody beautiful. And the slugs, they get right in there, and they're nibbling all the leaves. Look at all these little holes and stuff in the leaves. Actually, they're, pr they're pretty good. But trust me, she goes mental. She goes out here at night looking for slugs and getting rid of them. Well, I can save her all that hassle, can't I? You know? Buy some little cheeky signs. Cool. Anyway, what I was saying is it's really dark PLA that I'm using. The slugs and snails come out at night. So... I've got some glow-in-the-dark paint and I'm going to paint all the letters so they glow at night time. Yes, you know tunnel get bags, you can't get the better of me. Right, well here we go. I've painted it up. I'll go and show Ivy this in a moment, my missus, and see what she thinks. And we'll put it next to her favourite plant and we'll see if it makes a difference. Right, now... I've put this on Facebook and I've put it on Twitter and people say that slugs and snails aren't very good readers. Now I know that the snails aren't that good at reading but slugs are a bit better so I think slugs will be fine with this. But for the snails I've done a braille version. Oh, I've missed one there. Well, that's, that's not going to work. Yeah. There you go. There we are. That should help. Done. You are there, Ivy? Yeah. She's out doing her gardening people. Here she is. You know you've got problems with slugs and snails, Ivy? Yeah. I've made you a sign. I can't see it. I can't even see it. it it's, it's small for the slugs and snails, so it's, it's not really for humans to read. <laughs> I've done it snail and slug sized. Which, which plant of yours is getting eaten by the slugs and snails? Everywhere. Everywhere. But which one can I put this near to as a test to see if it stops oh, yeah, it? Over there where the squash is. And there's there. I want to put it nearer to the house, really. And then, um... That's where they go. Okay, all right. We'll go put it where we've got the proper problem. Oh, your strawberries have been eaten here. Can I put it in this pot? No? no? Okay. All right. Down here, by these big leaves. Yeah. Okay. All right. Here we go. By this lovely bird bath. And I've got a little spike on here, so I should be able to just push it into the ground like that there we go hold on sorry Ivy what did you say I thought you were going to paint it well I have painted it I've painted it in glow in the dark paint now this one here is braille Fuck sake so What's the, that? well it's for the slugs and snails that can't read you know snails aren't very good readers Slugs, slugs aren't so bad, so I've made a braille one. I'm going to put that in front of the sign so they can crawl over it. So even if they can't read it, at least if they know braille, they'll be fine. All right. <laughs> well, here we go. It's either going to work or it's not going to work, you know? There we are. Done. And that should glow at night as well. Perfect. So people, if you want to see how Ivy does all this lovely gardening, she's got her own channel. Check her out. It's Manila London. I want to say a massive great big thank you to all the people on Facebook 
and over on Twitter that gave feedback on these signs. Thank you. A lot of people told me that they can't read or they're not that good at reading, so hence the Braille version. If you want links to these print files, they're in the video description. They make a perfect joke type gift for people out there, yeah. This has all been satire and a joke. <laughs> Hopefully you've enjoyed it. Till next time, goodbye, goodbye, and goodbye again.